What's up everyone? Just wanted to pop in and let you guys know that we did do a little bit of stuff to the Hemi engine. The Jeep is still together as of right now. It's still my daily driver. Everything is still in one piece. The Hemi is still on the pallet, but just wanted to kind of show you guys what's going on here. So what, what I have done is we have taken the factory intake manifold off. So this will get sold. Usually there are people with 5.7 Hemis that they will put these on to get better airflow as well as the exhaust manifolds. These are actually the same ones as the uh, Hellcats. So I'll be selling these as well. What I am doing is I have gone with, I don't like this intake. I don't like the way it looks. I like the way it functions. So this is the Holly Sniper EFI uh, high ram. For those who know, this is basically an air gap. Okay, so the reason why I went with this is because on the factory 6.4 intake manifold, you can see that the throttle body comes out here and then the air box routes to the passenger side if, if this was a car. I don't want that. I want to keep my air box on the, I want to keep my air box on the passenger side of my Jeep. So we have gone with this intake manifold to have it come straight out and then I can run the air intake over to the passenger side of my Jeep. So right now all we've done is clean this up put the intake on it's just sitting on here it's not bolted obviously put the throttle body on the new intake and put the map sensor on the back this intake does come with new fuel rails that will go on like i said i'll be selling the manifolds i cannot use this transmission because it is not a four-wheel drive i will not be able to use most of this wiring harness either that will be getting sold this intake will be getting sold the computer will be getting sold the <clears throat> gas pedal and brake pedal will be getting sold. Um, so basically, I can't use 90% of this but the engine. So this is where it's sitting right now. Like I said, still on the pallet. We have not started tearing into the Jeep to pull the 3.6 out yet. But wanted to pop on and let you guys know this is what we're working on when it warms up a little bit and once 90% of the swap kit stuff arrives hope you guys are excited to see this swap and project take place hopefully uh i don't know if we're going to be able to get this done before we leave for s'more in april or not maybe fingers crossed maybe fingers crossed we will see but i will kind of do what ben did and try to get this video taped as much as possible just so there's somebody else out there other than Ben and Lightbright that I know of that have actually gone through this process and uh, recorded the whole procedure or surgery, we'll say. So hope you guys enjoy this and hope you guys have a great day. Stay warm. Bye.